guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel the way i get excited anytime i turn on my camera and shoot a video because i'm proving to myself that i can do it and i'm doing it and i'll do it anyway guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's so good to have you guys here i hope you are well blessed and kept of the lord and guys welcome and welcome back here so guys if you're new here karibu sana if you're a returning subscriber then you are the best so guys karibu ni sana now again it's my better judgment against against because i wanted to start this video tomorrow in the morning tomorrow is jamhuri day today is monday tomorrow is, will be the tuesday of the 12th that is a holiday i wanted to start the video tomorrow because the summer will be going but i've decided to start it right now because in the previous video you saw me buy cereals and things and i said that i wanted to make githeri and i told you guys that we will do that together as i show you how we do it and store it but now because i found my girl had already boiled them i'm just going to show you how we do it it's quite a lot so i'm going to make some for dinner then the rest of it we are going to pack it and put it in the fridge so that's the reason why i've started this video here in the kitchen looking like a typical mom but i don't mind because i am i am a mom i am a mom so let me show you the githeri because i start blabbing when i'm hungry a lot of things happen a lot today i've not eaten so when i'm hungry a lot of things can go wrong <laughs> many many things can be that's the githeri it's already done so it's really nice i'm going to make this for supper for the adults and then for the boys i'm going to cook for them some sweet potato so the one that will remain i'll pack it with you guys and then she also boiled the sweet potatoes and doma these are perfect perfect for breakfast so i'm also going to pack these and put them in the fridge they're still warm so we're going to give them time to cool let me ice around then tomorrow morning we're going to make this juice that my heart really loves and for some reason guys there's the akujakwana the pineapples have not been in the market so now because they're back that's his signature juice i have to make it so we're going to do this tomorrow and then we're going to boil the rest of the cereals in the morning the ndengu and the kamande we're going to do them in the morning before we before we if we are going before we go so guys that's it i'm just going to leave it here then when i'm packing i'm going to pick you guys up so guys uh i normally pack my sweet potatoes together and the arrowroots together then i just put them in the freezer and when you need to take them for breakfast you just pick a piece peel it and put it in the microwave to warm it so this is how i prefer to do it and they end up lasting us a week also i always wash them before i boil i wash them thoroughly to get rid of any mud or any dirt before i boil them So guys, for the ndoma and the guashes, I don't put them in the freezer. I put them in the fridge. <laughs> Never letting go Now that I have it We 
So guys, in the evening after they had cooled when we came back from our outing, that's when I packed the dengue and kamande. Oh, every little thing you do, every time you hold me, take me higher. How are you doing? I'm coffee. So um I'm from work and I just had a, a shower. <laughs> Am I color coordinating? What are these? Pink and red. Anyway, let me not digress. So uh yesterday on Jamuhuri Day, uh, a page that I really re okay. A page that I really really like uh, is selling was selling some pieces that have been eyeing uh, at a cheaper cheaper price. It's called Kenwell. It's on Instagram. I'm going to take a screen record and put it here. Yes. So I got some pieces, and she delivered today. And guys, let me tell you that lady has such a sweet sweet heart. Yani. Ha, ha, the way she talks on phone, the way she just responds to you, uh, her calling you for delivery, the way smoothless. I, I love her. I love, love, love her. And does such an, an amazing, amazing job. So I got this Vimonos. This one was looking like a burnt orange in the page, but it's kind of brown. You see that Kikuyu brown? Yes. And this one now they normally go for 1600 but I got this one for 950 I got both of them for 950 and if you ask me that's a big 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 sale so they have pockets and they are so good let me wear let me bring you guys down then I wear it So this is how it looks a little bit more. So this is how it looks. It has a really, really nice finishing. Now you can see me. It has a really, really nice finishing and it has pockets. So for 950, this is really, really, really extremely dope. Yes, love it. Yani, I cannot overemphasize how good this looks. You don't like the She's wearing the kimono here. Because she sent me the videos so you can see because hers I know they are they are way better than hers are way better than mine and I think I'm coming down with a cold anyway this is the second one it has that burnt orange vibe from my bed it's a really nice print guys do you see that oh this with the vision is a black tight, a black top, white sneakers, and this on top. Do you see the vision? <laughs> God. Let me also show you how this looks. So when you're ordering, tell her your size, but you see, they're, they're quite big. Yeah, so let me show you how this one looks. Longer 
such good quality pieces and one thing i love about her her vitenges don't fade they don't they don't fade and that is one thing that i really really love about her and it's actually quite a good heavy material it's not like the heaviest of vitenges but it's it's actually really nice it's it's really nice i hope you guys can can see you see Again, these are the two prints I got you might not get them when you go to order from her you might not get the exact pieces but uh, you'll get something really really nice from her so yeah let, let's see how the the video unfolds but this 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 purchase it's making my heart really glad So guys, the next thing we are doing is we are making our dress and I lost footage so I'm going to explain the process to you. So the first thing I did was I, I peeled the pineapples then I took the pineapple peels and boiled them. That's why you're going to see that this is extremely hot and you can see fumes. And then the rest of the pineapple, I just blended it and I used this sieve to sieve out anything extra I throw away, only the juice goes in. Remember as you boil your pineapple, as you rather blend, blend with some ginger and lemon. Ginger and lemon guys. So the process is really, really simple. All you have to do is boil the peels and with some water and then the, the the insides of the pineapple just blend them blend everything together and mix it up and our juice is ready i am not a fan of this juice but my man swears by it so yeah with his word <laughs> we can use his word as reference because i it's it's really really healthy and it's also really really good when you're having a cold this can act as a mm, homa dawa and it's really really nice i want to know your dark side i want to know your secret so guys make this juice and tell me in the comment section how it turns out yes, i want to be your lifeline so i wait for you wait for me wait for you wait for me hi guys i'm coffee i'm good uh -huh. today saturday i'm getting ready to go to pass by githurai market kama kawaida like that's a ritual it's it has to be done religiously every week because if i try and say that i'll be buying my groceries from the mama boga i'll end up spending so much money so i need to go and buy groceries for the week and i'm here because i want after gedurai i'm going to town we need to fix this mess that is this hair we need to fix this and my toes depends on my toes look horrible and kept and bad so i'm in this dress let me show you how it looks i'm going to throw in this long long sweater because the nairobi weather is doing its thing this morning <laughs> people in this house when i'm recording they look at me like a mad woman anyway <clears throat> so guys i was saying that i'm in a dress because i'm going to do my pedicure and i don't want I want it to be done thoroughly and when I'm in a trouser it doesn't they don't do it well or they ask you to change into their lesso and I I don't want that or those robes that they give you I don't want that anyway it's it's been raining so I know that Gedorai is a mud ground that's why I'm carrying my gumboots these are what I'm wearing now uh, after I finish shopping I'm going to wear these as i go to do my manicure my manicure pedicure and we fix this mess because christmas is here yes sir. so this is the sweater that i'm wearing let me show you guys how it looks pa 
You saved me. I never be the same. You saved me. It's like I can't walk on the ceiling. It's not this, but got me dreaming. You see? The sweater is quite long, so it will pass up the purpose of this cold Nairobi weather. But let's go do some self maintenance and come looking all nice and clean. And you know, yeah, you know what I mean. Anyway, guys, I don't want to blab. Also, guys, I finished King of Wrath yesterday, it was good, it was good. And then I started this. A page turner, a page turner. I must say, I've already read like most of it. This good. This is the second book of the King of Sin series. This is King of Pride. The first one was King of Wrath, which I've read, and quite frankly, it's very, very nice. So now we are on to this one, the King of Pride. I'm going to be reading this as I do my hair they do my hair and blah 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 i also want to do to tint my eyebrows so i'll show you that when we are done with the video anyway guys uh let's get straight into the the rest of the of the of the day as it unfolds and i didn't show what i got because it's the same thing that i got in the previous video but coming together right saves you money Hi guys, I'm Kofiti. So, same day, I'm back home. Today has been a roller coaster. Yo! <laughs> First of all, can I hear some commotion for the hair and the tinted eyebrows? Let me bring you guys in closer. So the eyebrows have been applied here and that's why they look like this they say that they should last around two weeks give or take so i can't really tell guys i had told you today i'm going to so make my nails and my feet that didn't happen because i don't even know what to say i went to the salon my guy dan was not there someone else made my hair it was terrible the old me would have been like, okay, I'll just go home like that. But the new me, ah, pana, I work hard for my money. I'm not going for mediocre. So they had to redo the hair all over again, put it in hot water, put me in the dryer for a second time. Yo. Ah. So I ended up wasting my time there. So that's why I didn't do my nails. But this one will hold until Monday because today is Saturday. So Monday I have errands to run. And that's when I'll go and do my my manicure, pay, my money pedi. But at least the hair didn't turn out badly. Not as I would wanted it because Dan is... Dan does such a good job. Yo, Dan does a good job. I will never, never, ever, ever, ever have these artificial locks touched by anyone other than him. The guy has gifted hands and I, I wish I waited for him. But anyway, lesson learned. So guys, because I'm back home, I wanted to show you something. My girl, 
did some nice nice wraps let me show you what she did so these are the wraps samosa wraps that she did she does a good good job and she did several of the samosa wraps so we're going to be making samosas and as usual they should make me a bed in the supermarket because like i said guys there's always something that is not there in this house there's always 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 something that i have to get anyway i got that box of milk i got some minced meat for the samosas what else did i get i didn't even know they pack salt like this but this is so nice this was 95 shillings salt okay that's a new way of doing it i got some cooking oil this one is just to last us for the few days remaining before the month ends i got some beef brown mm -hmm. i got self-raising flour for pancakes and last but not least i got sugar so that's what I got in the supermarket and of course I told you guys that I was going in the market in the morning and I got everything necessary I needed. But that's it guys. Let me end this video here. Thank you so much for watching this video until the end. See you in the next one because what a day. What a day guys. God bless you hugely hugely for me and bye bye.